applying global filters and Atlas TI-9 windows. Here you see the document manager. If you select a group in the filter area on the left, you set a local filter. If you open the context menu with a right click, you can set a group as a global filter. This means the entire project is filtered and now only the documents of the filtered group are visible and included in any subsequent analysis. Let's take a look at the effect that a global document filter has on the quotation manager. You will only see the quotations of the documents that pass the filter criteria. Also pay attention to how global filters are indicated. They show the color of the entity that is filtered, for example, orange for quotations or blue for documents. You can also apply global filters when retrieving quotations of a code. Or when retrieving quotations of a code group. Let's take a look at how global filters can be applied to tables. Here we see an analysis in the code co-occurrence table. The results reflect the data of the entire project. To apply a filter to this table, open the Document Groups branch in the Project Explorer, select a group, right-click, and set it as a global filter. Currently, only document groups can be used as a global filter. If you want to filter by only one document, you have to create a group for it. In the same way, you can filter the results of the code document table.